Let's create this type effect together in Photoshop. First, convert your type layer into a smart object, duplicate the layer once, and disable the visibility of the topmost layer. With the bottom type layer selected, go to Filter, Blur Gallery, Path Blur. In the Settings window, increase the Speed and Taper sliders, and then disable the Centered Blur. Click and drag on the tip of the arrow that's over your text and point it where you want this ghostly blur effect to reach. You can further customize the effect by enabling edit blur shapes and moving the red arrows for more control of the blur. Applying this effect, we're now ready to add some color. Turning on the visibility of the topmost type layer, add a slight Gaussian blur, and now we're ready for some color. Start by creating a new gradient map adjustment layer, then create a gradient with four to six contrasting colors. I've already gone ahead and made one, so I'll select my preset. It looks something like this along the gradient preview. To finalize everything, I'll select my black background layer along with all of my type layers, right click and convert to smart object. Now going to filter camera raw filter, I'll add some grain into the photo and now our effect is complete. Like and follow for more Photoshop tips like this.